and welcome to Richard Bozulich's Get Strong at Tsuji. Today we got some more intermediate problems, starting with problem number 386. How should black capture this white stone in the corner? Black should Atari from this way, and if white tries to resist by extending it, then black just follows. White has nowhere to go, and white is going to be captured. If black Ataris from the other way, then white has this move in Sente. If black ignores it, then white can come down and capture. So black is forced to capture the stone. And usually we don't want to give our opponent free sente moves like this. Problem number 394, how does black capture these two white stones? Black's move is to honey, and if white turns here, then black will block it. And if white tries to cut, then black will play here. Forcing white to capture, and this is just a squeeze ladder that dies immediately. Problem number 403, black is looking to capture these four white stones. How does he do this? Black's move is to Hana here, and if white cuts, black will just connect. If white Ataris, black will extend. And the really cool thing about this Tsuji, or at least this problem, is that when white plays here, black can actually Tanuki. Because this group has so many liberties, black can Tanuki and be fine. Even if white starts the capturing race by taking a liberty, black has this move, which is Atari, forcing white to capture, then can throw in and Atari, and this is just going to die instantly. If after white cuts here, black plays here, white can capture, black can play here, uh, white cannot play here, this is self Atari. If white Ataris, black will just connect. Um, white is in serious trouble, similar to before. Problem number 409, how does black capture these four white stones in the corner? Black's move is the cut. If white tries to resist by playing here, black will play here, and this just ends in a ladder squeeze immediately. Um, if after cutting, white plays here, this is another two stone tower to Suji, black will extend. If white Ataris, then black will cut, forcing capture, and it will die. Problem number 425, how does black rescue these four stones right here? Black's move is the net. However, white has a strong resistance by cutting here. This is Atari, and so black will need to connect. And now this net is ineffective because white can push through. However, black has the cover here, forcing white to capture, and this just ends up in a squeeze ladder. And black is fine. Problem number 426, how does black capture these four white stones here? Black's move is the throw-in, and if white captures, then black can play here. If white connects, this just ends in a ladder right away, so white needs to give them up and play here, forcing black to capture, and now white can take Sente elsewhere. Alternatively, if white doesn't capture, white has a few options available. White can play here to capture the two stones directly. This is Sente against black, forcing him to capture, because if black doesn't do that and plays elsewhere, then white can capture and connect and save those stones. Um, likewise, if white plays here, this is also Sente forcing him back to capture. However, white ends in Gote because now white needs to come back and capture the two stones. If white doesn't, then black can save them with a move like this. So white's best move is to capture the two stones, forcing black to capture, and take Sente elsewhere. So that is it for another set of intermediate problems. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please like it. If you're new around here, subscribe. And if you have any questions, comments, suggestions, or feedback, please leave them below. Thanks again so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.